Hi, I'm Bart Rosen, and welcome to Rapala How To TV. Today we're casting crankbaits. We're focusing in on one in particular, the Rapala Shad Rap, one of the best baits out there for catching fish. We're going to go through a few different techniques to help you work this bait and to make your fishing more effective. Come on, let's go. Everybody knows about the straight retrieve. Rapples are built to mimic that wounded minnow action right out of the box. Most of the time, that's all the action you need to catch fish. On a straight retrieve, shad wraps already have that incredible wounded minnow action, as do all the rapala lures. Basically, you're just casting it out and bringing it back. You can change it up a little bit by varying your retrieve speeds. Speed it up or slow it down. But some days that simply doesn't trigger the fish. When a straight retrieve isn't producing, one of the things that you can try is incorporating a pause into your retrieve. What I like to do is crank the bait back. Crank it back at a medium to medium slow speed. Stop it for about a second, then pick the retrieve back up again. A lot of times, executing a series of these pauses and varying your retrieve speed is all it takes to trigger the strike. If a pause isn't producing, another thing you can do is incorporate a series of twitches into the retrieve. So just like the pause, you want to retrieve the bait back straight in. Pause it, twitch it a couple of times, by just simply popping your rod tip, then pick the retrieve back up again. By mixing in a series of these twitches, it's sure to trigger those negative fish. So come back and join us again and learn how to catch more fish like this on Rafla How To TV.